Good evening, it's Monday the 15th of February, welcome to announcements. Pause there because it's not actually Monday, I'm recording this on Sunday in an attempt to get ahead of the game, uh, which uh, might, might come back to bite me later. Today I've got a few things to talk about. Um, we'll start with the results of the Silverstone half, sorry, the Silverstone virtual run. Um, as it's Sunday, I'm not sure that all the results are up yet, and also uh, club names didn't seem to appear, so I've had to have a search and hope for the best. So if I missed you or your result isn't up yet, um, apologies, let me know and I will make sure you get into the results next week. So I just found two Bomba Harriers. Um, we had Nick Hilton in the half marathon in 136 and Claire Daniels in the 10k in 1 hour 15 minutes and 50 seconds. Both fantastic results, well done, uh, and fantastic effort getting out on a cold and slightly miserable weekend to take part in the virtual event. Um, we've also got uh, one of our own club events uh, now live again. So Dave has um, organised a brilliant sounding event, um, Park, uh, Park, Park Run, Park Place. Uh, sorry, Dave, forgotten the name. Um, it's, uh, it looks like great fun, it involves running around parks, uh, be team-based again. Um, there's no deadline to sign up, but the sooner you sign up, the better. So, uh, so check that out and get in touch if you've got any questions. Um, I'm also really pleased to announce that we will be doing um, our AGM and awards uh, in one go this year. So normally we, we run it as two separate events. This year we'll be doing it in, in one. Um, of course, it will be online, uh, as has everything else been this year, via Zoom, um, and we'll be doing it on the 25th of March this year. The awards will be a slightly slimmed down version to normal. Um, clearly, we haven't had a lot of the events and structure that normally uh, lets us um, uh, give out things like uh, achievement, merit, athlete, that sort of thing. Um, but we will, be, we will be carrying some of them through. Um, and in particular, I'd like to invite everyone to nominate their club member of the year. Uh, so for those who, who don't know or have forgotten, um, every club member can nominate um, any other members to be as their member of the year. Uh, you need to email me. Um, I'll put my email address in the comments um, with your nominee and the reason for nominating them. And then it will go to a vote of the membership. Um, there'll also be a vote for race report of the year, so the committee will be um, uh, sending out a survey with uh, each of the, the nominees for race report of the year as well. Finally, um, just wanted to acknowledge that it's been a bit quiet on, on my front this week. Um, I did not do announcements last week or a Friday post. Uh, apologies for that. I think it's been a bit of a it's been a bit of a tough year for everyone so far, and uh, I think. Uh, things certainly got to me last week. Um, I've been hugely cheered by how many people have got in touch with me to check everything's all right. Um, and the reason I want to share this is just to say, uh, do you get in touch with each other? Because it's it's so great to hear from uh, from your running friends, from your tail family, um, just checking in and making sure you're doing okay. So um, so I'm certainly taking that. Uh, for next week to get in touch with some of my own friends and, and really encourage you all to do the same. And equally, if you are struggling, do get in touch with someone, meet up for a walk or a run. Um, I was out on the canal this morning, bumped into quite a few uh, Tealsters. It was great, had a quick chat, um, really enjoyed seeing everyone, enjoyed running a little bit with, with John and Claire as well. Uh, and yeah, just had a great time. So that's it from me. Uh, hope everyone has a great week.